I'm Lila Ibrahim. And I'm Jesse Simsack. Welcome to Beyond the Metal, the AP's complete coverage of the 2010 Winter Games. Jess, we are standing outside of the taping of the Stephen Colbert Show here in Vancouver, but we will tell you more about that in just a minute. But first, let's get to today's news. Lindsey Vaughn has won gold in the women's downhill. The delay in weather may have worked in Vaughn's favor, giving her bruised shin a few extra days to heal. Late Wednesday, Shawnee Davis added gold in 1,000-meter speed skating. His victory gave the United States its fourth gold medal. The fifth gold came for the U.S. as Sean White defended his Olympic title in men's halfpipe, with U.S. team rider Scotty Lego taking bronze. Short track speed skater Apollo Anton Ono also had a good night Wednesday, easily advancing through the preliminaries in the men's thousand. A lot happening in news around the games and also a lot happening on Facebook. So we brought back Randy Zuckerberg from Facebook to kind of tell us the hot things trending right now. Thanks. That's right. There's been a lot of great activity on Facebook over the course of this entire week. Of course, the big story from yesterday, Lindsey Vaughn taking home the gold. She immediately went to her Facebook page to update her status saying, yay, this is the best day of my life and immediately got hundreds of comments and likes on that. I still love the real time of all of this. It's right. so interesting to see it happen as, it, you know, as it's going yeah, it's on. It's interesting. It's the, the first place that the athletes go to update their fans. Uh, but then you also have the great page that you guys are doing with the AP Winter Games page on Facebook and where not only can you see what athletes are doing, but you get updates from over 100 journalists and photographers on the ground. So. And, really comprehensive. It's a little unique, kind of behind the scenes, what, what we have going on with That's you guys. That's right, and uh, we have our, our little videos posted there, of course, every day, and the great That's interviews right. you guys are doing with some of these athletes. Yep. Well, let's check out the AP's Winter Game page on Facebook. Looks like this first article here is written by Andrew Damp. Lindsey Vaughn takes gold at the Olympics in women's downhill. Awesome. Then we have another post here written by national writer Eddie Pels. It's on snowboarding. Looks like he'll be taking your questions. You can go on here, write him a little note. Snowboarding being one of my favorite sports, I think that'd be pretty cool to write a national writer and ask him a few questions. Then up here on the AP Winter Games page, you can click on the tab at the top, Beyond the Metal, find out what me and Lila are doing and uh, what we've been up to. Then for all your Winter Games results, you can click on the Winter Games Network tab and check out all the athletes' profiles and latest scores. Again, facebook.com slash AP Winter Games or yeah. wintergames.ap.org. Yeah, I just recently did an interview with uh, two-time gold medalist Seth Westcott, and you can check that video out on the AP Facebook site or at wintergames.ap.org. That's right, and while you're there, you can watch Jesse and I go bungee jumping as well. But before you get to all that... See us at the taping of the Colbert Show, where we spoke with some proud Canadians about the uh, American comedian that sometimes pokes fun at them. Be sure to check it out. Stephen Colbert, who has been critical of Canada and the access U.S. athletes are being given to the Olympic speed skating oval, was in Vancouver to film his show at the Winter Games. We talked to a few people about Colbert, and this is what they said. He puts Canada in the spotlight, though. He supports them, right? I know he's making uh, fun of, he's supporting his team, right? Just like we're supporting our team, right? So. He gets a little <laughs> extreme at times, but he makes a good point. <laughs> oh, Canada, we stand on guard. Games at AP.org for all of your Winter Games coverage. Check it out. Thanks.